Card tester Matis Kurat says you can pack quite a bit of stuff in a freight train, but you can't make that claim for economy class cars. It's an issue manufacturers have been trying to solve for a few years, says Matis, and one of their attempts is what he's looking at today, the Seat Ibiza ST. Up front, it's a standard economy car, but it has a station wagon sized trunk. Seat offers six different motors for the Ibiza ST. Matis tested their most powerful diesel, which packs 105 horsepower. This spring, the compact was launched at the Geneva Motor Show. Since then, Seat has acquired some competition. Both Peugeot and Skoda have introduced similar models, the 207 SW and a shorter Fabia. Mata says that the large windows and visibility are very nice and that he never has the feeling that he has to strain to see something. It's actually pretty ideal, but the windshield is less than perfect, he thinks, because towards the bottom it distorts your view and makes it look like the lane markings are coming toward the driver. If you have a weak stomach, he says, it can make you feel a little queasy. Now that we've heard about the risks, let's check out the car's positive side. The Ibiza ST is a lot of fun to drive. Its electronic stability control and anti-brake lock system are series features, as is its braking distribution system. The car is sporty and looks sweet, but is it really a good vehicle for everyday wear and tear? Mata says that although using the same white from the doors for the dashboard might look nice, he doesn't think it will stay that way. He suspects that it will start to look dirty before long. The stand for the navigational system is a nice touch. Just pop the lid and plug the GPS device straight in. It makes those annoying hanging cables a thing of the past. The nose of the car is typically beats him, although the stretch version is 18 centimeters longer. The back end sports a spoiler on top with an integrated third brake light. So what does Montes think? Is the economy car slash station wagon a sound investment? And how much cargo space does it have anyway? Our tester says that the ST is a good vehicle for anyone who actually wants a small car, either because you do a lot of city driving or maybe because of the price, but also needs a little more space. We haven't discussed that yet, he says, so let's take a look at it. The trunk has a volume of around 430 liters if you pack it completely full. Lowering the rear seat is a slightly clumsy operation because you have to fold forward the seat itself, then remove the headrest, then lower the backrest. Even after all that, he says, the trunk floor isn't flat, which is a little annoying. But you do have over 1,100 liters of cargo space. The standard four-door Ibiza has just 290 liters. That means there's plenty of room for all kinds of things, says Matis. Baby carriages, cases of drinks, or luggage. Or you could just crawl in there yourself when you need to take a break.